Hi everybody, this is Dr. A. Continuing our basics of the lab uh, in hematology, we're going to look at the retic counts. The retic count, also known as the reticulocyte count. A reticulocyte is the non-nucleated stage of red cell development that precedes the mature red cell or erythrocyte. It's basically the stage between when the red cell has spit out its nucleus, but it's not mature yet. That's reticulocyte. Retics will contain RNA that will present as granules or filaments when they're stained with a supravital stain, just as new methylene blue. And retics generally persist in the circulation for one to two days before they fully mature into erythrocytes. An elevation in the retic count is seen in patients with anemia, secondary to acute blood loss, or anemia secondary to hemolysis, which is the shredding or tearing of the red cell membrane which results in the destruction of the red cell. Since retics are basically early red cells, anything that would cause a bone marrow to have to increase the amount of red cells that are made to make up for losing some red cells will increase the retic count and you'll see more retics. Because uh, basically they're cranking them out as fast as it can and so they'll crank out some of these immature ones out there um, and they'll mature up while they're in the blood's um, stream, but they can still carry oxygen and do the job they need to do. A normal range for a retic, this is if everything's going well, uh, there's no stress on the system and bone marrow production is average, the normal range is going to be 0.5 to 1.5%, and that would be of the cells in circulation, 0.5 to 1.5% of those cells are reticulocytes. These slides show what they would look like. So this is um, a right stain, so a, a traditional blood smear where you can assess the red cells and these little larger, darker bluish staining um, red cells are reticulocytes. And then um, these right here is, uh, it shows the new methylene blue stain and the ones with the inclusions that stains RNA those would be your reticulocytes, the ones that don't have inclusions of RNA or your normal red cells. And that is the reticulocyte. Thank you.